1st September 2022 Morning Mushli Am Shante Bhattada Madhupan Sweet children, you Brahmins now have to interact with even greater royalty than the deities because you now belong to the incorporeal and corporeal elevated clans. Question Which children's faces remain in bloom like flowers? Answer Those who have the incognito happiness of claiming their unlimited inheritance from the Father and are becoming the masters of the world. Those who are becoming Satapridhan with knowledge and yoga, such souls continue to become pure. The faces of such children remain happily in bloom like flowers. Those souls will continue to receive strength. Dwells of knowledge will continue to emerge from their lips and they will become rube and basant. They will continue to have visions of the new kingdom. Song To live in your lane and to die in your lane. Om Shanti Sweetest children, you have understood very clearly that you have to become a garden around Baba's neck. Who said this? The soul said, Now I want to become a garden around your neck. Body consciousness has to be renounced. We will now be traded in the rosary of Rudra. You have to return home. Therefore, renounce body consciousness while alive. A soul is a child of the Supreme Soul. We are now claiming our inheritance from Him. Your children should have this intoxication and your intellects will then go to Shri Baba. We souls are His children. You have now become His grandchildren through Brahma. Baba is incorporeal and Dada is corporeal. The Father is the highest on high. Important, while the people live with great royalty, they have the intoxication of their position. Your children should have a lot of happiness inside you. To stay in remembrance of the Father is the state of soul consciousness through which you benefit a great deal. Your children know that you are God's children, that you are the children of Brahma. Baba says, you are my children anyway. I now adopt you through Brahma. You should have the intoxication that you belong to the incorporeal and corporeal elevated Brahmin clans. You have to consider yourselves to be Brahmins. You children of God are the children of Brahma. You Brahmins know that you are becoming deities. You mustn't forget this. You Brahmins have to interact with even greater royalty than the deities. Your life becomes invaluable at this time. It was previously like a shell and it is now becoming like a diamond and this is why you are praised. Temples have also been created as your memorials. There is also the memorial to Somnath, means Lord of Nectar, the one who made the deities what they were. There is your memorial to Somnath gave imperishable jewels of knowledge and so they created such a beautiful temple to him. When you hear the song, you understand that you have to become a garland around Shri Baba's neck. Baba is teaching us. You should also have the happiness of who it is who is teaching you. When you first learn the alphabet, you learn it while sitting on the floor. Then you sit on benches and then on chairs. Prince and princesses sit on coaches in their college. It isn't a prince or princess who teaches them. It is just another teacher. The status of prince and princesses is higher. You are even higher than the golden age prince and princesses. They are only the children of the deities. You are the children of God. You have to remember the one from whom you are to claim your inheritance. Why? Sitting walking and interacting with everyone you mustn't forget him it is only by having remembrance that you become healthy and wealthy a father wills everything to his children 
and goes into the stage of retirement. Therefore, nothing then remains his. He gives everything away. He also will everything to Baba. Baba, all of this is yours. Baba then says, Okay, look after it as trustees. You make me into the trustees and I then make you into trustees. Therefore, you have to follow Srimad. You mustn't do any wrong business. Continue to ask me. Some don't even know how children should eat their food. There is great praise of Brahma Bhojan. Even deities have a desire for Brahma Bhojan. And this is why you take Brahma Bhojan. This Brahma Bhojan has a lot of strength. As you make further progress, yogis will prepare all the food. At the moment, you are all effort makers. You continue to make effort to stay in remembrance of Sri Baba as much as possible. You are his children. Your children who ate this will continue to become very strong. Therefore, strong, firm, ones who prepare food will also emerge. The speak of Brahma Bhojan, not Shiv Bhojan. The speak of the Bhandara of Shiv. Whatever it sent became pure in Shri Baba's Bhandara. This is Shri Baba's Bhandara. Baba has told you that at Srinathadwari they have wells of ghee. They cook very rich food there. Whereas at Jagannathadwari they cook very simple food. There is a difference. That one is ugly and this one is beautiful. Srinath has a lot of wealth. Whereas people there, means near Orissa, are not that wealthy. There are the wealthy and the poor. You are now very poor and you will then become wealthy. At this time, you are very poor. There, you will receive 36 varieties of food. Therefore, such preparations have to be made. Although even the subjects are able to eat 36 varieties of food, the status of the kings is still higher. The food there is very first class. Everything there is even quality. Here, everything is head quality. There is the difference of day and night. All the harvest of the grains, etc. that they have here goes rotten. Your children should have a lot of intoxication. When someone passes an important examination, he becomes very intoxicated. You should have very elevated intoxication. That God, who is the bestower of salvation for all, is teaching you. The father says, I am your obedient servant. A father is his children's obedient servant. He sends everything he has to his children and then goes into the stage of retirement. The father says, I too surrender myself. However, you surrender yourself first. When a person dies, all of his belongings are given to the Karnigor, means a special Brahman priest. If a wealthy person dies, they even give away his furniture, etc. What do your children give? Rubbish. What do you receive in return for that? Only the poor ones claim the inheritance. They send it themselves. What does Baba take from you and what does he give you? Therefore, your children should have a lot of intoxication. You have found the unlimited Baba who washes the dirty impure clothes. Sikh say, Guru Nanak spoke the virgins from which they made the Granth, means Sikh scripture. The people of Bharat don't even know who spoke their Gita, who the God of the Gita is, or which religion was established through it. They simply speak of the Hindu religion. They speak of the Aryan religion, but they don't understand the meaning of that at all. They believe that there was the Aryan religion, but now the whole of Bharat is an Aryan, means not reformed. That is just a name given by Dayananda. The branches that emerge later grow quickly. You have to make a lot of effort. They don't take time to convert others. Here, 
there is no question of converting others. Here, you have to change from Shudras into Brahmins. To become a Brahmin is not going to your auntie's home. Some fail while moving along. Baba says, even if someone cuts your throat, you mustn't become impure. Some ask Baba, what can I do under the circumstances? Baba then understands that that one is unable to enter it. In that case, Baba would say, go and become impure. It depends on you. They would beat you in this one bird, but you would be slaughtering yourself for 21 birds. Maya slaps you very hard while you move along. This is boxing. She knocks you down with one punch. Some who have been coming from the beginning or for 15 to 20 years are such that they completely leave everything and die. They are so sensitive. When a mistake is made, there has to be repentance for that. The father explains to you, children, you do that disservice. That is not right. Teachings are given. No one is bitten here. Some say that when their children at home are very troublesome, they have to be slapped. Baba says, okay, in order to benefit them, you may pull their ears a little, but explain with a lot of love as much as possible. It is said of Krishna that he was tied up with string. However, children there don't cause such mischief. It is only the children of this time who are so troublesome. The father explains children, the destination is very high. Ask about every situation and Baba will continue to give you methods. Each one's illness is different. You have to be cautious at every step. Otherwise, you will be deceived. Became very, very sweet. Shri Baba, it's so sweet and lovely. Your children should also become like him. The father would want his children to become higher than him and glorify their name. Became so first class that your status becomes higher than mine. He truly gives you a high status. No one would even be able to understand how you became the masters of the world. Therefore, your behavior should be very royal. Your walking, moving, speaking and eating should all be very royal. Internally, there should be great happiness that you are the children of God. The picture of Lakshmi and Narayan is visible whereas you are incognito. Only Brahmins know you Brahmins. No one else knows you. You know that you are claiming your inheritance from Baba in an incognito form and becoming the masters of the world. The status you receive is very high. That gives you a lot of internal happiness. Make such effort that your faces bloom like flowers. No one has become like that yet. You have to make effort. As you make further progress, there will be a lot of regard for you. You have to give knowledge to the sannyasis and also to the kings at the end. When you have received full strength, you have to become Satupradhan with knowledge and the power of yoga. Only let jewels emerge constantly from your lips and you will become Rup and Basant. You souls will continue to become pure. The closer you come, the more happiness you will feel inside. You will also continue to have visions of your kingdom. You have to Make effort in a very incognito way. You have to show others the path. All of you are Draupadis. Baba says, these assaults will have to be tolerated for Baba's sake. There is so much purity in the golden age. It is called a hundred percent voiceless world. It is now a hundred percent vicious world. It is in your entering that you are now racing the spiritual race of yoga in order to become the garland around Shubhaba's neck. You will then become the garland around Vishnu's neck. Your first clan is that of Brahmins. You then become deities and warriors. This stage of descent takes you a whole cycle, whereas it takes you a second to ascend. It is now your stage of ascent. You simply have to remember Baba. This is your final report. It takes you 84 births to fall down. 
You continue to climb and thus both. Baba gives you liberation and life in a second. You should have that happiness. You can see the contrast between what you would become with that knowledge and what you will become with this knowledge. You have to study this as well as that. Baba says, while living at home with your families, make effort for the future. Fulfill your responsibilities to both your worldly family and your divine family. Baba sees the account of each of you and then shows you a method accordingly. This is how you should do this. If someone becomes angry, you have to remain very sweet. Even if someone insults you, just continue to smile. Acha, you are insulting me, but I am offering you flowers. That person will then become completely quiet. He or she will cool down in just a minute. Baba is the great entertainer. He shows you many tactics. He purifies the impure. Therefore, he has to have those tactics. You have to take Srimad. You have come here to become elevated by taking Srimad. Acha to the sweetest, beloved, long lost and now found children. Love, remembrance and good morning. From the mother, the father, Bhattada, the spiritual father says Namaste to the spiritual children. The spiritual children says Namaste and good partnering to the spiritual father. Essence for the dharna. First point, become so first class, sweet and royal that you glorify the father's name. Even if someone becomes angry or insults you, Simply continue to smile. Second point, become a complete trustee by following Srimad. Don't do any wrong business. Surrender yourselves completely. Blessing, may you become filled with the awareness of being an ancestor and sustain everyone with your pure attitude and the power of your mind. Explanation, when you meet or see souls of any other religion, have the awareness that all of those souls are from the dynasty of your great great grandfather. You Brahmin souls are the ancestors, and ancestors sustain everyone. With alokic sustenance, you have to fill all souls with all the powers you have received from the father. Whatever power a soul needs, sustain that soul with that power. For this, your attitude has to be very pure and your mind has to be powerful slogan those who have the imperishable wealth knowledge are the wealthiest of all in the world om shanti